Hey, what's up music lovers? How was your day or night wherever you are? Saan mang kayo sa mundo? Hello. Well, we are going to talk about certain music genres that we have been outdated with. Yet these music genres are out there waiting for us to have them listened to and have them discovered by those who haven't tried these kinds of music. This will be a pilot episode of this music genre series where we will be listening to some specific music genres for us who wants to discover this music and who knows you would probably like or even love these kinds of music. It's not just simple pop, rock, metal, jazz, soul, worship. Now what is vaporwave music? Have you ever heard of vaporwave music or have you discovered this vaporwave music genre? Well, you may have been indulged to this genre and in this lifestyle actually. You just didn't knew you were into this. The related aesthetics, the likes of color, gender orientation, your original preferences of music and stuff like that. Now, after this small talk, I will be giving you a sample vaporwave music to listen to. Well, with this video, it will be just one, probably a five minute long vaporwave music. But please check out my other videos where you can listen to hours long vaporwave music, where you can download it for free. Just notify me so I know where the songs are going. Before we continue this video, please press the like button and if you are new here, please subscribe to my channel and support my content. Support your music boy from Discover Sudi Music. Visit my other talks and music videos and all of them are free. Free music for your background and for your personal use. Chill music for hangouts and if you really really want a cool playlist for your business to avoid music copyright hassles for your business in your public places please inform me in the comments below then we can talk about this now back to our topic according to wikipedia vaporwave is a micro genre it is a micro genre of electronic music a visual art style an internet meme that emerged in the early 2010. It is defined partly by its slowed down, chopped and screwed samples of smooth jazz, elevator music, R&B, and lounge music from the 1980s and 1990s. Its cultural origins are from the early 2010 and from the internet, and typical instruments use are audio editing software, the DO or the digital audio workstation, some sequencers, and some samplers. I will be posting links in my description of the reference I will be using in this video. What you are listening right now in my background is vaporwave music. Now, according to fandom.com, Vaporwave is a music genre branching from electronic chill wave, but the unique and iconic visual aesthetic cultivated alongside it is now debatably more popular and recognizable than the music itself. Vaporwave is an aesthetic and movement that has been described as a tongue-in-cheek commentary on modern consumerism and the soulless glamour of late capitalism. The decade of origin is from 2010. The creators are James Ferraro, Daniel Lopanit, and Ramona Xavier, 
key motifs are 70s, 80s, and 90s anime, Japanese language, 3D graphics, computer OS. Now, not just computer OS, the old computer OS, like the Windows 95, marble statues, iconic vaporwave songs, and Macintosh Plus. Now, the key colors are pink, blue, purple, and mostly of it, neon. Some related aesthetics are anime, cassette futurism, clean core, cyberpunk, glitch, ice punk, lo-fi, new age, old web, synth wave, new wave, city pump, and other more. Now the related brands for Vaporwave, you know this, Nike. Vaporwave, like many other aesthetics, give you nostalgia. Even if you weren't around from the 1980s to early 2000s, both the images and music, mostly the music, send you to an era that once was. Now the bright colors and simple shapes would later inspire media and products aimed at children and youth of the era including Nickelodeon, MTV, Discovery Zone, and Kid Core, which given the time period it was popular in. It is debated when the period that Vaporwave is centered around ended. Some mark the September 11, 2001 terrorist attack as the ending point. There is an air of ambiguity of whether Vaporwave artists are either celebrating the rampant capitalism that birthed the Vaporwave aesthetics. Ironically, mocking the hollowness of a lot of these visual cues which mistakes shallowness for death or just happens to think they look or sound cool or nostalgic. It is generally left up to the listener as to what they think the artist meant with the final work. Which is supposedly true when you are a musician with your own music. Popular visuals utilized in vaporwave aesthetics can include, but are not limited to, anime, cartoons, Sailor Moon, Simpsons, consumerism such as Adidas, Pepsi Cola, Nike, Microsoft Windows, PlayStation. And now with its music, Vaporwave was first characterized by its, by its heavy use of samples from the 1980s to the 1990s, typically lounge, smooth jazz, or music. Samples are often pitched down layered or altered in classic chop. However, Vaporwave has started to incorporate more original compositions with a heavy focus on ambience. Artists have also started to get creative with the physical mediums they sell their albums on, ranging from the conventional vinyl and cassette to the unusual mini discs and floppy discs. There are so many Vaporwave artists out there that we won't be able to exactly list them off. Also, Vaporwave, unsurprisingly, also has a rather strong and thriving presence in video games. So here is a Vaporwave sample. Hit me in the comments about your feedback. Do you like the music? Do you find it boring? Your feelings when you hear this kind of music. I appreciate it much if you write down any comments.
So what do you think of the music? Pretty cool, huh? So nostalgic. Some 90s, early 2000 feeling there. And it feels good, right? I hope you like this video. Don't forget to like the video and again, check out my other music videos. You can have those music for free. Just inform me, message me in my Facebook account. Just search for Discover City Music. Message me so we could talk about it. Again, this is Jeff of Discover City Music. What music have you discovered today? And I'll see you in the next video.